Hey loves! So one of my favorite videos to watch during the month is your Ipsy unboxing videos. I love seeing your guys' reactions to the month's products and everything, but what I'm always upset about is how unhappy some of you guys are with the products that you received and your actual Ipsy match results. So because of that, I decided to make this video today on how you guys can help us help you and improve your overall Ipsy match results and be overall just more happier with the bags that you receive. So first off, those of you guys who don't know what Ipsy is, I will go ahead and put all the information in the down bar below. So be sure to check that out and just please be aware that it is only for US and Canada. Um, all of you guys who are international, I will actually be doing a giveaway of a few glam bags that I've put together myself with my own products and just things that I've had myself and that will be on my blog. So, so I will also put all that information in the bottom bar below so you guys can go check that out because I don't want you international subscribers to be upset that you can't participate and cannot receive glam bags. So with all that said, the first thing that you guys need to understand is Ipsy Match is first and foremost an algorithm. And if you guys don't know what an algorithm is, it is basically one big math equation. So Ipsy Match basically takes all the information that you give to us in your quiz, as well as the reviews and feedback that you give us in your glam room. And we take all of this information, stick it in this Ipsy Match algorithm and out pops your best optimized bag. And this basically means with all the information that you give us, we use it to match you with whatever bag combination, say there's 15 or so bag combinations with the best bag possible for you based on the results that you've given us. So with all this information, we're always trying to give you the best bag possible, but you guys also need to remember that Ipsy is about trying new things and discovering new products. So even though you may not be happy with all the products that you've received, it's also just a way for you to try new things and kind of step out of your comfort zone just a little bit more so you can experience new products and brands that you may have not picked up on your own. So here's how to make sure you get the most out of your bag. So first and foremost, you guys need to know you can always retake your beauty quiz. And just so you guys know, our quiz is most helpful when you only choose the most relevant answers. And specifically, less is more. This way we have a clear idea of what your true style is. So say you want more simple and natural looking makeup. Be sure to only select those relevant items and don't say you're super adventurous when it comes to trying out makeup because it's more likely that you'll receive something like a deep smoky eye kit. Another thing you guys need to know is that the quiz is structured so you guys can indicate your favorite types of items, not tell us what you don't want. So by saying that you like lipstick and lip gloss and blush and eyeshadows, that just tells us that those are your favorite types of items and those items you'd be most happy receiving. So even though you don't select something like nail polish or tools, you still may get them in your bag because there's no way to completely opt out of specific types of items. And also be sure to go back to your glam room and review all the products that you get. So say you get false eyelashes, be sure to review it and tell us that you don't like false eyelashes so that it is less likely in the future that you'll get them in another bag. And you guys should also be aware that we like to match products with the current season that we're in as well as the bag's current theme. So for March, the theme was Destination Beauty and here is the bag that I received. So all the items for this month were basically to give you the feeling that you're on an exotic vacation. So I received the Pixie Flawless Beauty Primer. A Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie in the color Get Ready. A Be A Bombshell Eyeshadow Quad and this is in the colors Bora Bora. So just looking at these colors, you guys know that we want you to have that tropical, exotic feeling. Like you can wear these eyeshadows and imagine you're on an exotic vacation somewhere far off. And lastly, I got the Nicole by OPI Ruffles Nail Polish. So this is a gorgeous color, really great. Um, the color is very good for springtime. And hopefully by seeing my month's items, you guys get how we try to match the products a little bit more with the current month's theme. And one last thing, I did want to talk about the bag. So this bag was um, created by an artist named Clary Reese. So the little tag on the front just says, the print of this exclusive Ipsy makeup bag is a selection from artist Clary Reese. Um, it's from her geography-based series, Street Anatomy, and it showcases San Francisco, which is Reese's hometown, as also um, where Ipsy headquarters is located. And you can also um, 
learn more about Clari by visiting her website at www.clariart.com. So hopefully this video gave you guys a little bit more insight about Ipsy Match and how um, our algorithm works and hopefully this will help you guys to um, basically redo your beauty quiz as well as be sure to um, review all the items that you get in every month's bag so that hopefully in future months you guys will be happier with the products that you receive. So lastly, be sure to check out the giveaway that will be going on on my blog and I will also put all the information that I said in this video on a blog post so that you guys can reference that in case you don't want to watch this video again. You guys can just reference that blog post when you are redoing your quiz and reviewing your items and all that. So hopefully you guys found this video helpful and hopefully this does really help improve your guys' Ipsy Match results. So you guys are happier overall with your future Ipsy Glam Bags. And and yeah, I guess that's it. Thank you guys as always so, so much for watching and I will see you all in the later video. Bye guys.